Okay, I got everything for today for my class. Time to head out in a little bit. Still gotta get ready and take this uh, nasal strip off. One, two, three, hit it! <laughs> All right, load it up. Gotta head to class right now to Visalia. Gotta go. I'm here. See it? Right there? So I'm here in class right now. We're about to get started. Gotta keep it all quiet. So. Last name is done that. And all you guys do all day long is those fades. Fade, 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 fade. Up the sides, two blades, one blade, zero. Air. And they don't want it short, and they want to pick it out, and they want it cut. You can't come in and go clink, clink, clink. You pick it out, and you stand at the right level. You put that steel blade right across that hair, and you just come right on in there. Start doing this. Now, what am I doing? I'm putting water on the top, and it's dry as a bone <coughs> underneath. So all the water is running on the floor. You come underneath, and you put some water underneath. You put the water underneath first. You don't necessarily have to pick it up, but put some water underneath. I ain't comb her in. Do you ever put hair tonic in your water? I don't. That mean for the smell? No. Um, I, a lot of people, well, the older guys that I've cut with, they, they've all put hair tonic for like the old men because it helps, like, it doesn't get it as, it gets it damp, it doesn't get it as wet, and it's like easier to like uh, comb back and all that. Well, I put I put cream rinse in them. Are you talking about hair tonic? Or are you talking it's about a green bottle. Oh, uh, is it Jarrus? That's yeah. Uh, let me see. I'll, I'll find it right now. So right Jarris, now we're that's not, that's not, change the hair. That's an actual well, uh, how you would wet no, the hair. I know, I know, like, in order to get the hair to comb the way you're supposed to. I'll explain later. But, well, don't say it. Spill on your hands. Then you're going to set the mannequin up, and you're now going to separate it in four, or not necessarily in four sections at first. You have one section in the back that's going to be for your perm rods. So all you're going to do is wet the back. After that, then you are going to section this off in four sections. In this section, you're going to demonstrate the hair straightening or the hair relaxing. If I try to pull this out, it ain't coming out. I mean, I'm going to, I can't, well, it might, but it's not supposed to. But if I fit my thumb right there, I can take this out and swing it all over the place. It's not coming out of my, it's not going to come out of my hand. I let loose of that, and I'm not going to be able to hold it very long. It's going to come out of my hand. So that's just a little, that's the way of locking the hair into your, into your hand. And are we able to, if you, if you need to hold the hair for some reason. I pick this hair up, and all of a sudden I'm looking at it, and I'm seeing these little white, these little white things on the hair, on the hair shaft. And they're like, they look like they're glued on there, and they're little white, look like little pieces of rice. And I think my thumb will go across them like that, and they go thump, 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 and they don't come off. What do I have? Lice. Lice. I don't actually have rice, I've got the knit. The knit is a louse egg. But the louse egg is there, that means the louse is there because even the yeah. yeah. yeah, this is a pretty cool cool barber shop. It's got like an old school feel to it. So yeah. It's again to look at some of these people's uh, you know you know, boots and whatnot. The front's pretty cool. Let's go check it out. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that. They got a deer with uh, some graduation glasses on. <laughs> That's pretty cool. And the entrance. Yeah. Real nice here. Over here. They got like these kind of bottles and all and uh, different business cards. Yeah. Oh, little Western cowboy themed doors, you know. It's really cool, man. It's a real cool shop they got here. Oh, check this out. This here is the whole city of Visalia. So, <laughs> yeah, time to check out. <sighs> okay, got done handling my business. Just got done buying a tripod and my mannequin to practice my hair cutting and all that good stuff. It's lunchtime. It's time to go. Woo! Oh my god. Okay. Just got home. About to have lunch. Then I gotta pee. 
And after that, I'm going to show you all how to shave shaving cream off a balloon. Let's hope this doesn't go hilariously, uh, well, hilariously bad. Maybe hilariously good, but hilariously not bad. Yeah, you know what? Scratch that. Uh, I'm going to have to do that tomorrow, guys. It is way too hot to go in the garage and demonstrate that. <sighs> that shaving cream off a balloon thing. <sighs> Not going to do it right now when this heat in the garage. When it's this hot. No. Yeah, sorry about that, guys. I uh, got caught up with some stuff. But I'm back now. Straight razor, balloon, shaving cream. Let's get to it. All right, that's good. Let's tie it up. Foam shaving cream. There we go. <laughs> Almost popped it. Almost popped it. Well, guys, this is going to be it for today. Thanks for watching. Please be sure to hit that like button. And if you want to be around my channel a little bit more than usual, please be sure to hit that subscribe button. To keep up to date with what I'm doing, just follow me on these apps to make sure about the new content that I'm putting out on this vlog and so forth. All right, guys, you're awesome. Thank you. God bless. Goodbye. See you in the next vlog.